I'm at a loss for words. Now at five, her friend is missing, presumed dead. The prime suspect, the victim's husband, who's charged with murder. Who she loved, who was supposed to keep her safe. Tonight, the search continues. There's a large amount of evidence uh, to indicate that somebody did not leave that house alive. As investigators piece together what happened to Irene Zanidi. And deputies say Zanidi's husband said she left her home after an argument, but investigators say the evidence does not add up. Well, CBS 4 Ted Scouten is following this case. He joins us from Pompano Beach, an area where deputies have been searching. He has the latest on the investigation and reaction from a friend of Zanidi's, Ted. Yeah, this is a case where a husband is accused of killing his wife. At this point, investigators are still trying to find that body. Now, the investigation led them here. This is the Hillsborough Inlet in Pompano Beach, but they still need help from the public. I'm at a loss for words. I really don't know what to say other than continue to beg the community in helping finding my friend Letty, who was brutally taken away from us. Please for help in finding the body of Irene Lanning Zanidi, known as Letty, to her friends. BSO said she was last seen alive on May 21st in the early morning hours. Her husband, Ian Lanning, is under arrest, accused of murder. Detectives say they found strong evidence in the couple's Pompano Beach home. They said it appeared someone tried to clean the area. Committing a crime is, is not very easy without leaving evidence. Um, uh, I can tell you there was an extensive amount of, of evidence in that house, and uh, you know, it, it paints a very gruesome picture. So um, we're, we're confident that, uh, that Irene is, is, is deceased. Detectives also checked Ian Lanning's car. We did process that vehicle, and there was something that, an indication that a body had been in the car. Uh, a deceased body. Investigators tell us they were able to track Ian's movements in the early morning of May 21st, leading them here to the Hillsborough Inlet, wondering if her body was dumped here. Obviously, some of the evidence we have indicate that he's frequenting, frequenting the, the inlet area, the intercoastal areas, anywhere from Hillsborough Inlet uh, south to maybe 14th Street Causeway. Investigators began their search in the intercoastal at the Hillsborough Inlet, then expanded north to Boca Raton and south to the 14th Street Causeway and out into the ocean. They're also looking beyond. They and friends want anyone with information to come forward. Somebody had to have seen something, and somebody needs to come forward. Her children deserve that. Um, she deserves that. You know, the most horrific thing has happened to her and her family, and we should be able to properly lay her to rest. Family, friends, uh, investigators, all pleading for information in this case. If you have anything that can help those investigators, give Broward Crime Stoppers a call. That number is 954-493-TIPS. Live in Pompano Beach, Ted Scouten, CBS4 News.